Yes! <laughs> Real crazy ass boy! You nasty. What's up, nasty cats? It's your man behind the cam director here with another Ruby reaction, volume 6, chapter 12, reaction. Seeing red. In the last reaction, yo, we got to see two massive fights. On one hand, we got to see Team Ruby and Joran versus the giant mech that is Caroline and the Argus military might on the other hand we had blake fighting adam 1v1 until yang jumped in he with some dynamic entry hit him in his damn chest and let him know that hey we're protecting each other it's a two for one special you about to catch four hands for the price of none and i can't wait to see the conclusion of that fight although i'm sure adam is gonna you know try to put up a valiant effort he's not in the right state of mind not to mention both ladies have experienced a whole lot of growth that's gonna allow them to fight together to make sure he gets pounded into the ground which might be something he's into but no kink shaming in this guild okay uh, on the other side of things team ruby and team jordan did a fantastic job uh keeping caroline at bay but at this point, they're just slightly outmatched, you know? They got the shields down, but she still got the firepower of like, I don't know, a, a, basically a kaiju killer. It's tough, it's a tough situation. Um, I think their best bet is a push over and John her ass, but that's just me. Someone say I'm out of pocket. I say, are you trying to get the Atlas or nah? Just saying. Oh, uh, with that being said, we're gonna jump right into this reaction because we don't know what red we're about to start seeing. So if you made it this far and you haven't already, go drop a sub on the channel, drop a like on the video, hit the bell for post notifications because we post content three times a week and you don't want to miss out. If you want to catch me, I'm live on Twitch every Monday and Friday, 7 p.m. Eastern. Check the description below for the Twitch link and of course the Patreon link where you find uncut, unreleased anime and Ruby reactions. Ruby. Volume 6, Chapter 12 Reaction, Seeing Red, coming up next. Hey, just a quick thank you to all the subs on the channel. You members of the Nasty cast are the driving force that makes all this possible. Catch Director Nasty on Reddit, Patreon, and all other socials in the description below with links. Also, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks again. Cap, uh, we're talking about how Adam is about to get a two for one special of hands from the ladies. Uh, the thing is, the hands will come for free because we don't want his. I'm really hoping he gets beaten to the ground and learns his place and just leaves Blake alone. Just go, bro. You lost. I honestly hope they kill him and or take him in. They won't kill him because they're hunters and huntresses. But hopefully they capture him and return him to the proper authorities. Although he may just escape because they usually do. On the other hand of things, I was talking about how Maria only shot one rocket. She should have shot all of them at her ass to get it over with. I think their best chance at winning is to trip and drown her. Or you just got to get in there and kill the little lady. But they're not, again, they're not murderers. I know that's not going to happen. But I'm interested to see if the ship is okay and how they're going to conclude this mech fight. Also, comment down below if you like these mini intros during the mu during the uh, intros. I know a lot of people love the music, love the intros, but I also like to use it as a moment to connect because I know a lot of people skip the intro. So please, of course, let me know down below. But honestly, if you're seeing this one, that probably means I did it for the whole volume already. So like, sorry. Jeez. They're really cheering for her right now? That'd be crazy. Hey, what was that red blip? Damn. Wow. So the ship is okay. Ruby made it. Crazy. They're up. I mean, we know they'd be able to. 
Yeah. Yeah. Can you make that kind of shot? We'll only get one chance before she catches on. I'd have to be practically staring down the barrel of her cannon. Well, I've got a way to guarantee that. Wow. She's like, I got a way to get you into the barrel of the cannon. <laughs> One missing, you say? That's a shame, Maria, because I have plenty. Are you too crazy? Yes. The best approach is simply the most <gasps> Maria, crazy ass boy. <laughs> nope. No, you're not. Pull up! <laughs> this man ain't never played a video game in his damn life. E for now. Tough. Ruby, stop. I need you to trust me. Damn, she's like, get off me, son. <laughs> We're going to Atlas. Bigger people than you have tried to stop us and failed. But we're supposed to be on the same side. We're supposed to use our power to protect people. But you just use yours to look down on everyone. We didn't want to steal from you. We did it because you gave us no other choice. I mean, now I'm giving you facts. Yeah, talk no jutsu did not work. She's genius. Somebody get her weapon! Get the hell out of there! I told you. Oh, don't tell me I missed it. <laughs> you knew you <laughs> this shit was a what makes you so sure you can win now? I don't have a choice. I have people who actually care about me. And I promised I'd never leave them again. So I'm not dying now. 
You know, she made a promise to me once that she'd always be at my I'm a mammy man. And look how well she's kept it. Did she make that promise to you? Or to the person you were pretending to be? Got him! Bitch! So I just wasn't good enough for you. You know it's so much more than that. I know you've made your choice. And I've made mine. You choose death! Yo, they've been fighting together, bro. You're not gonna win this. You're literally about to get your ass juggled on some Smash Bros. Oof. 1v1. Moment of you... truth, Yang. You think you're faster than you were at Beacon? You need it. Your aura is bound to be running low. You're one to talk, fam. You're just a coward like her. Yeah, now it's time to turn it on. Ha, oh, your ass grass, ho. She will win, put your ass in the dirt. Don't let him fall. Don't let him fall. Keep the body. Damn it. Ooh. Okay, he might be dead. Yo, I didn't think they're going to do it, yo. I ain't gonna lie to you. I did not think they had that gangster in them. Whew. I'm not gonna break your promise. I swear. I know you won't. Bruh. Yo, man. I didn't think they're gonna do it. I didn't think they'd have the balls to do it. <laughs> Yo, she called the whole military, bro. We've been trying to reach you. Argus is in danger. What? Oh, shit. 
What a tangled web we weave. That was volume six, chapter 12, seeing red. And yeah, we saw some red. I said in the intro of this, if nobody watched, that I didn't think the girls would have the conviction to kill him. That they would like knock him out, bring him in, but he'd probably escape. Nah, they killed him. He dead. He dead, dead too. He hit that rock, man. Listen, I'm always, I'm always, my thing is always, when a villain dies, I want to see the body. Bring the body. Hang the body out. Make sure everybody sees, like, they're dead, dead, dead. I want a doctor's confirmation. Give me a note. I want the whole morgue report. Anytime a body goes missing, I never believe they're gone. But he looked dead, bro. Like, you dead. Ain't nobody, you stabbed two holes. Ain't nobody gonna come looking for you. You was bleeding. You hit that rock on the way down. You got some brain damage, image, image, image. Yo, I'm gonna say he's gone on this one. At the end, what a wild twist and turn. While Caroline is out here playing with Team Ruby and getting her cannon all shot up and messed up, of course Argus is currently being attacked by a Leviathan, aka Godzilla, and just a whole mess of Grimm. And of course, your best chance at survival, Team Ruby and Jorn, you just wore them the fuck out. And your cannon don't work no more, shoddy. What you gonna do? This is a mess. In my opinion, I've learned now, officially in Ruby, they're not afraid to murder characters. I need to be okay with that. I got it locked in. Characters will die, they will not return sometimes. Got it. He dead, bro. I'm assuming he dead. Penny, she ain't coming back. Pira, not coming back. Although those two are painful, this one, this one felt good. So moving forward, yeah, the Grimmer here. A lot of negative emotion. I should have figured that out. They're trying to leave. They're trying to escape. The hate between Maria and Cordova. I don't think that's enough to attract the Grimm. I do think it happens to be one of those things like coincidental. But it won't be surprising me if the negative emotion here led to it anyways. It, it really wouldn't. Uh, with that being said, we're going to jump into the next one. If you made it this far and you haven't already, go drop a sub on the channel. Drop a like on the video. Hit the bell for post notifications. We post content three times a week and you don't want to miss out. If you want to catch me, I'm live on Twitch every Monday and Friday, 7 p.m. Eastern. Check the description for the Twitch link and, of course, the Patreon link where you find uncut, unreleased <laughs> anime and Ruby reactions. I'm your man behind the cam, and that's my oven. Y'all stay nasty. You're nasty.